Hey folks, want to make a short video of the O scope on on my Class D amplifier here. Uh, made a couple changes, um, mostly being a LC uh, low pass filter network, parallel cap, series inductor. Um, it's just a little one to three transformer. I'm using the uh, high turns uh, winding as a series and shorting out the low turns winding. Um, just as a bit of an inductor there to uh, kind of keep the high frequency uh, 35 kilohertz down a bit. Same setup as before, still got the arc going there and whatnot. I have the waveforms here on the scope being displayed and uh, one thing I have right now is I have it set to um, half a millisecond trigger um, and what that does is it lets you see the envelope on the, uh, the waveform which is of course the audio, the low frequency stuff. If you wanted to look at the actual waveforms, you can see pretty clearly there. Uh, middle trace, top trace, is the signal going to the speaker. That is, of course, um, tapped off of the flyback there, a small winding on top, which goes through the low pass uh, network. The bottom trace is on a times 100 probe, and that is right at the drain of the. Uh, MOSFET there, right on the, the cap, I'm pulling it off of it, essentially right at the drain. Um, since it's single-ended operation for this, I don't need a differential scope, I just need to connect uh, it to the high end and have a, of course, high voltage probe, which I do there, 2 kilovolt probe. So that's what the waveforms look like, pretty good, um, you know, there's some ring ringing on the, uh, the low frequency end, but that's that's fine, um, middle trace it is. The, uh, uh, high voltage trace uh, looks great. You know, you can see um, right there how clean it is. It's just wonderful. And of course, if I turn on audio, you can see the frequency vibrating a bit because that's what pulse width modulation does uh, when you have this kind of setup. And if I change the time base there, kind of shade it a little bit to. So you can see it better. You can see the envelope, which is carrying the audio information. Oh, there you go.